Hi, my name is Huey Smith, and this is a video of how food has influenced my personal life. Um, for about the first 13 years of my life, I didn't have any restrictions on food. Um, my family ate out a lot because we were fortunate enough to have some money, and um, so we ate out a lot. My mom cooked a little bit, but due to our after-school activities, we did eat out a lot. Um, that changed, though, when I turned 13. My sister had an allergic reaction one day at school to some foods, so my mom decided to get her tested for allergies. And when hers came back that she had a lot of allergies, my mom decided to get me, my sister, and her tested. And mine came back with the results that I was allergic to gluten, dairy, eggs, soy, um, peanuts, like just a bunch of different foods that I could not eat because I was over the charts with. Um, this ended up changing my life because I had to stop eating all these foods, which was really hard. So for the first two years after I found out I was allergic to all these foods, which might I add, was the summer before my freshman year of high school. Um, the, those first two years were pretty hard for me. Um, my mom decided to go hardcore on the diet uh, with the allergies, and so I did not eat at all gluten, dairy, soy, eggs, all of those foods. Um, it became very hard because my family couldn't really eat out um, because most places don't have restrictions for all of those foods. So we pretty much ate at home a lot, which changed for my family a, a lot because we used to eat out. And uh, when we went on vacations, it was hard to find places we could eat. I was a volley I'm a volleyball player, so tournaments were hard because I had to bring all my own food. My mom would have to make me breakfast, bring me my own lunch. I couldn't eat what the team was eating. Dinners were hard when we go out as a team. It was just really hard for me. Um, and I just really didn't like those first two years. At this time, my mom also decided that we were going to start eating uh, only healthy foods for the majority. So all of the sugars in our house pretty much went away for at least the first two years. Um, and we went on pretty much a strictly no allergy and uh, all healthy food diet. It was really hard for me those first two years also because um, I couldn't eat the sweets that I ever wanted to. My mom tried to get uh, sweets that we could eat, but they weren't the same as normals. Some of them tasted really gross, um, and so we kind of just didn't eat them. So for my junior and senior year of high school, my mom kind of relaxed on our diet. Uh, she still wanted us to try not to eat these foods, but she realized that it was super, super hard to maintain this diet um, and live a normal life. So we would keep to the diet when we were at home, um, but if we were on vacation or if we were eating out, um, if we could, we'd eat the diet. But if they didn't have the options, we wouldn't stress about it. We'd just eat whatever. So it was a lot better for me. I didn't have to stress out when I went to tournaments or on vacation. I could kind of just live a little bit better and breathe more. Um, I didn't have to always worry about what I was eating and if I would get sick or something, even though I never really had a reaction which made it even harder to stay on my diet. But it ended up being okay those second two years because my mom had kind of relaxed a bit. Then after I graduated from high school, um, I moved away from home, moved here from Vegas, and I decided that I wasn't going to stick with my diet of eating, of not eating these foods. And I talked to my mom about it for a while and she seemed okay with it since I don't really have a reaction to these foods. Um, it's not a life or death or anything like that, so it was okay if I got off my diet completely. Um, so I've kind of just been back to the first 13 years of my life where I don't have any restrictions. I do eat a lot healthier, um, but because I'm on my own now and have to afford everything by myself, those gluten-free products cost more money. Um, so I kind of just do whatever, and when I go home, for holidays or just for the weekend, I do go back to my diet because my mom uh, helps us stay out of the gluten area when possible. And so when I do go home, I stay off of it, but when I'm at school, I just kind of eat whatever I want. 